Hello, Scratchers wanting to use the Newgrounds API. I'm Obvious Lexi, and I'll teach you how to use it. So, once you have the extension loaded in, what you can do is you can go to Events, or wherever your main loop starts. And for me, I'll just drag in a new flag. And you're going to want to connect to your game. Now you can find the game ID and the game code on the Newgrounds website. So let me pull up a tab for that. So you can go to your game. For me, it'll be in My Projects, Newgrounds API Test. And it'll be scroll, you can scroll down here and go to API Tools. Now, once you got those, which I have those stored variables here, you will want to change your game's version to whatever it is. This isn't strictly necessary, but it's good practice. And then you're going to want to drag out the if login required hat just to see if the user can log in and prompt login if login is required. Now let's wrap these in a new grounds block just for convenience in case we want to use any other API or publish this to anywhere else. Now know about these user username and Newgrounds supporter blocks. These will take a second or two to get all the data from Newgrounds before you can use them. So let's just have it say our username. So we'll put that in a forever loop after we grab the API. And let's put it in a uh, logged in. Thing. I'll just add a thing saying not logged in just in case. Now this seems good. So let's test it out. To test it out, you're going to have to package it. So you can do that by just clicking on File, Package Project. And it should open up in a new tab or window, depending on if you're using the web or browser client. Let's scroll down here. And you're going to want this to be in zip mode. We can package this. Throw it in here. And go to new grounds once again. We upload our file preview just to make sure it works and as you can see we're logged in let's evoke this metal for myself and let's test out the metal api so for this i'm gonna go grab the uh, metal id real quick so on the uh API dashboard, you can scroll down here to metals, and you see this metal ID. You copy this number, and let's just hook this up to clicking the dango. So, when the dango is clicked, we will want to unlock the metal with that ID. But let's check for if it's unlocked already, too. If it is, we'll just have the metal say... We'll just have the dango say, I'm unlocked. We're actually, let's have it change color by 25 since we already have it saying our username. So we'll package this again. Go back onto new grounds. Oh, let's revert that. Edit the details of our game. Upload our file. Test it out. Our metal's locked. We click the dango. It's unlocked. That is a basic tutorial on some of the basic features of the Newgrounds API for Turbo War. I hope you enjoy.